Hello, how are you today? It's the final Wednesday of December and of the year, so it's time for me to talk about my December favourites. I hope you have had a great month and I hope you are enjoying a lovely Christmas season if you are celebrating. I have had a good month, December has been very good to me. I'm currently having a lovely Christmas holiday, a little Christmas break. I'm excited to talk about a few of my favourite things from December. Uh, so let's get started with some TV shows. Firstly, the BBC show Outlaws. I think this actually finished last month, but I finished it since the last favourites video, so it's going here. It's a six-part comedy about a group of people doing community service. It's by Stephen Merchant, and the cast includes Eleanor Tomlinson and Christopher Walken. The first episode of the show, I wasn't super fussed about it, but um, it really grew on me over the course of the series, and I really enjoyed uh, it by the last few episodes and I recommend checking it out if you can. Secondly, I've started watching Wheel of Time which is on Amazon Prime Video. Only a few episodes in, I think my next episode is episode 4, so really early days. I haven't read the book so I can't comment on how good an adaptation it is, but I'm really enjoying the show. I think it's high quality and I'm interested to see where the story and the characters go. Also, Superman and Lois has come to the UK. Yay! It's on Saturdays uh, around 5, 5.15pm on BBC One. A really really weird time to be on, but it's the time where the old Superman series was on, uh, so it's really fun scheduling. I'm really enjoying it, it has the feel of the Superman TV show that I used to watch when I was a kid, and I like how we've moved on in the story a bit and you know we've got like the next generation. Really fun show, really enjoying it, have to watch it with subtitles, one of those shows where the sound does not come through very well on a domestic TV set, but it's really good apart from that. And finally, I want to mention the new series Around the World in 80 Days, which started on BBC One uh, this weekend. We have had two episodes so far. This is the new adaptation with David Tennant, and I was very impressed with the first couple of episodes. Worth looking up, if you can, I think. Now, a film, my favourite film this month was Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings. I'm finally on my way to catching up with my Marvel viewing, and I watched this film last week, and I really loved it. Some great characters, I loved the pace and the action. Really want to know what happens next with them all. Great film, I thought. Now, a couple of games. A new season of Fortnite has started, and I'm really loving this season. Whole new map, some great new consumables. Love Having, having tents, a lot of changes made all at once and almost all of them I am a fan of and I hope they stay as well because I think they've really added to the game. Also I really want to mention Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Uh, this game is continuing to impress me so much. It looks beautiful, there's so much variety in what you can do. I've been doing a lot of main quests recently and the story is really good. There's also been some really fun things like I went to the Olympics and I've now decided that I'm going to continue playing the Assassin's Creed series. I've had such a good first experience and I can't wait to try some of the other games. So when we finish Assassin's Creed Odyssey on stream, we're going straight to a different Assassin's Creed game. We're just going to have Assassin's Creed Tuesdays now. That's what we're going with. Uh, and it's going to be really fun. Now onto a clothing item. I bought a few items of clothing in the Black Friday sales and my favourite is this cardigan that I am wearing now. I'm a big fan of the two-tone style and this one is pink and brown. This is the only cardigan I have ever owned apart from in my old school uniform. Uh, so it's a momentous occasion and it's really soft and warm and thick. And it's from a brand called Daisy Street. Now appropriately for the month of December I'm going to talk about a few presents. Earlier on in the month I got these crocheted dice from Shelley. Look at the amount of work that has gone into these. There are seven of them. They're beautiful and perfect. I love the colours. I am so happy and thank you so much Shelley. And then for Christmas I got some Critical Role masks. Continuing my collection of Critical Role masks. Love the designs on these ones. I got some really pretty paper tape which I'm very excited about because I am getting into scrapbooking. I also got a little tripod adapter so that I can put my phone on my tripod. That's going to be very useful. And I also got a fair amount of chocolate, of which this is just a small collection. Big fan of a Ferrero Rocher, so I am looking forward to eating these. And two separate dime things. Some dime Mikado and also some dime Little Robins from Cadbury's. Can't wait to try them! And finally, a couple of purchases to end the video. Firstly, I got a little mini thermal printer, which is very cute and very useful. You can print stuff out in black and white from your phone. It's really cool. It's on sticker paper. Excellent for scrapbooking. I made all of my Christmas present tags with it this year. And also, I got myself a Dice Advent Calendar to use this month. I got it from the Critical Treasures shop on Etsy. It came in this. Um, and I'm going to show you the dice that I got. I'm going to show you them in close-up, uh, but they're all in this bag. Firstly, I got this little kind of oil slick set. 
uh, I guess that's what I'm calling them. I love the font on these. Then I got this nice black and yellow pattern set. I really love the pattern, especially on the D4. And then this really pretty, very clear pink set. And then on the 24th, I got this very fancy set, which is a sharp edge set. And it's got all these inclusions and I love it because it's very bright and colorful. And also there were two random trinkets in the calendar. So firstly, this little pin badge. But my favorite of the trinkets is this entire other die set. It's tiny and it's yellow, and I think it might actually be my favourite die set in the calendar because they're so cute, and I love the colour yellow. And I can just carry them around with me all the time, you know, for emergency Dungeons and Dragons needs. So yes, those are some of my favourite things from December. What a fun month! I would love to know what some of your favourite things have been from this month. Do let me know in the comments below, I'd love to hear about them. And also, do you have any thoughts on any of the things I've talked about today? I hope you have a wonderful rest of December, and Happy New Year if I don't speak to you before 2022. Thank you so much for watching this video, and let's move across to the end screen. If you'd like to see my latest video or some more favourites videos, then you can do that below me here. And if you'd like to subscribe to my channel or visit my website, then you can do that beside me here. Also, there's a link to my Patreon page in the description below if you'd like to check it out. Have a great day, and I will see you soon.